So great. Hey, we appreciate your time here on the NBC6 News at 4. The News at 5 starts right now. Now at 5 o'clock, a personal foul. A U.M. football player behind bars accused of attacking his pregnant ex-girlfriend. We're live. Then we now know who will be Runsey's replacement and become the new face of Broward County Public Schools for now. And our masks back. Why the White House is now considering asking Americans to mask up once again. Good evening. Thank you for joining us on our new home, our new set. I'm Juwan Strait. And I'm Jackie Nespro. Thanks for joining us on such an exciting day. All that and much more right now. NBC6 News starts with breaking news. We have that breaking news right out of Coral Springs. Another building in South Florida ordered to be vacated over safety concerns after the deadly Surfside building collapse. You're taking a look at it right now. People who live in the Villa Bianco condominium are being told they have to be out in two weeks. Officials say that the 16 unit condo failed to complete its 40 year building inspection, which was required in 2016. A judge also cites the building's further deterioration as reason for the evacuation. We'll continue to monitor this breaking news story throughout the afternoon. You can always go online at NBC6.com for more information. Also now at five o'clock off the field.